Okay, the next experiment that we can perform will test the dependence of Faraday's law on the number of windings. And to do that, I need to add some more windings to the pipe. And so first, before I take this apart, I'm going to make a note of which wire I've connected to negative and which one to positive. The negative was the very first one I put down, and the positive was the wire that I wrapped over. And then what I'll do for that is I'll take an extra wire, one of these on, in this other spool, and uncoil it, and I'm going to add it on to the wire. And I want to make sure that I get a good connection, electrical connection, put the spool there, and then that I wind it in the same direction. If you wind it in the opposite direction, the voltage, the EMF will cancel instead of add, and you'll, you'll get bad data. So I'm just going to take these two bare ends of the wire and twist them together. They don't have to be tight. We want to be able to undo them later. So I'll just cross them and give about three twists of wire. And then I'll take, I'm going to take the blue tape that holds it off and keep winding. I remember I had 20 windings here, so when I come back to the top here, that's 21. And 22, oh, I don't want to go too far, I don't want to go into the orange and blue tape, 23, wait a minute, let me make sure I got that right, there's 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, oh, I can get another one, so we'll go to 31. I don't have to get, I just want to add about 10 more, and I will tape that down. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 2000, 2001, 2002, 2003, 